We're having a complete transformation of our energy systems. That's the reason why we call it the energy transition. And at the heart of it, really, is our ability to keep our lights on so that our way of life, our communities, our homes, our businesses, and our economy continues to work. And so what we have to be able to do is to do this digitally to create the non-competing, non-differentiating code that will become the power systems of the future. LF Energy is an ecosystem to build that. The journey started in 2018 when RT partnered with the Linux Foundation to form an open source foundation dedicated to the needs of the energy transition. The first significant milestone was the announcement of the launch of LF Energy in July three years ago. Uh, so we looked at uh, Linux Foundation as a really valuable place to bring our projects that we've been working on um, and take it out from under our wing, put it into an actual governed public process um, and make it part of a larger set of solutions. At that time, we had uh, more questions than certainties about the path to be followed. However, we were driven by one conviction that this must happen. And here we are. Well, the energy systems are changing since their introduction. The power systems have changed dramatically due to the introduction of renewables and a simultaneous decommission of conventional generation. Together with ever-evolving markets, this further increases the complexity related to operation of power systems. We have a, a quite long list now of projects. They start from working at the edge of the grid, like in fledge power, going to the automation solution like Sonio, or other uh, important components like Compass, that are looking at the configuration of the automation and also looking at the user side with projects like Open Meter. We look at calculation problems related to power system like Impossible. So as you can understand, a software in the broader sense from automation to planning to uh, operation. And we are a growing, vibrant community that is literally transforming the world. LF Energy is three years old and we've come a long way and should be proud of that. So congratulations to all the community. The LF community is a very diverse community and that's one of the things I really like. Even though we're, we're not a huge uh, community yet, I think a big milestone was uh, having uh, Aliander uh, join us on the project. They've been really good uh, contributors. Progressively, uh, the community uh, learned to work uh, together and started thinking jointly uh, on the best way to, to address common issues. The LFA community is uh, also diverse, not only because of the type of stakeholders, but also the competences people have and the interests they have. There are people that have um, mostly the experience in developing the software solutions, but there are also the final users that are there to understand how those solutions are fitting their requirements. Now, LF Energy offers uh, some kind of pre-competitive uh, playing field where uh, utilities, technology vendors, IT service companies and academic institutions join their forces around shared goals. LF Energy organized a, a hackathon in early uh, 2020. Uh, it was a hackathon to uh, kind of bring together several uh, LF Energy projects. It was a good uh, opportunity to get to know the other projects, to get to know the people that were working uh, in other projects, because it's always easier to reach out to someone uh, once you have a first, uh, first contact. We are at an early phase of our journey and uh, at the same time we have to speed up. Our roadmap is driven by urgency. All those new challenges need to be addressed by the most of the uh, DSOs and DSO globally. So we have really an enormous opportunity to design those systems together. In order to support our operators, we need to design applications that combine the best of human and computer intelligence that will enable them to keep operating the grid effectively and reliably. We need to work with the community to build a coherent vision around these building blocks. We invite others to join us and we look forward to having you be part of our community.